Hey, it's Anna Marie from ERA King in Alabama. Um, got a little frustration this morning. Rode up and off on a house uh, early yesterday evening. And um, I get ready to send it over to the listing agent. She doesn't have her cell phone number available uh, online. It's not on the listing. It just all, she's listed it as her office number as the main way to get in touch with her. So I, I Googled her and looked for her personal website. Went to her personal website. She does have a contact me form, but it goes straight to like one of those blank, you just fill in your first name, last name. No way for me to email her the offer. Um, again, she has her office number listed as her primary contact number. Um, went into the MLS, because there's a roster. The email address, um, she doesn't have one on there. She just goes to, and she has no cell phone number listed either. So now I've been holding on to this offer uh, since 520 yesterday afternoon. Uh, it is now 10 till 9. I've left a message with her office and uh, just waiting until she calls into the office to check her messages or she goes into the office to check her messages to present this offer. And, you know, as frustrating it is as it is for me, I just, I feel sorry for her her sellers who have no idea that I have an offer in my hand for their house and um, because I can't get in touch with her there's no way for me to present this offer it's unbelievably frustrating as you can see so uh, you know if you get ready to list your house make sure that your agent uh, that you list with is easily accessible because I, I, I feel pretty sure I know how my sellers are you know they want to know as soon as possible when an offer comes in. So, like I said, I'm gonna sit here and wait for her to call me back, uh, cause I left messages yesterday and then I've already called again this morning and spoken with the receptionist at her office. Let her know to please call me cause I have an offer. So, hopefully she'll call soon.